What is going on my people? How was everybody doing and how was everybody prailing in today my people? Welcome back to another video and in today's video, I got a very special video for you all today. As you can see, I'm going to be showing you how to make prime Tyreek Evans. This is, man, when Tyreek Evans first came into the lead, he was going crazy. He was literally doing so much, so much damage. This is the small a uh, small forward version of Tariq Evans, but my people, when they moved him to point guard, oh my goodness, he started going crazy. So, as you can see, right? You're probably wondering, how did I get this? Listen, you have to try to find the secret sauce. I can't just give y'all the sauce like that. That's kind of crazy, you know what I'm saying? You know, you gotta be patient. But listen, right? So as you can see, driving layup, 86. The driving dunk 82 really really good he was an amazing finisher in the paint he could finish at will uh close shot is definitely there as well then you got the mid-range shot and three-point shot he wasn't known to be a shooter he wasn't a good shooter when he first came into the league he developed it he got decent at it but he was an inside guy you know what i mean facilitate you know break down his defender get into the paint he was nice with that so as you can see, post control 60. You see the ball handling at a 90, speed with ball 85, and pass accuracy 84. He was good with the he was good with the rock. He can handle the rock really, really good, you know. The defense, he wasn't known as a defender. So don't think that you're gonna get crazy defense with this. A 70 perimeter, trust me. If you've seen a lot of the people who are hooper it, trust me. They literally um be locking up with a 70 if you go on a rug or the park it shouldn't be an issue and then the speed 89 acceleration 89 and strength invert 73 so this build is looking nice so let's get to the mob play build and make the one and only Tyreek Evans all right my people so we in the mob play build as you can see so you, you want to go small forward right hand jersey number 13 don't worry about the face scan this is Rodman I've been hoping on my Dennis Rodman build as you can see got the afro and all that so 6'6 six, six on the height, then you want to go to 220. And the wingspan, you can just leave the wingspan exactly where it is. You don't got to mess with it. And then the body shape, we'll just leave it at size. All right, so first things first, right? Close shot was 86, so we're going to go 86 right here. You know what? We don't need to go 86, so let's save. So I'm, I'm big on saving attributes. All we need to do is go 85. That's going to give us that fast twitch on gold. Driving layer was an 86, so that's what we're gonna do. Let's go up. Do we need to go 86? Okay, so we don't need to go 86, nothing happens. So what I'm thinking is we just go to 84. Acrobat on gold. Driving dunk, he had a driving dunk of a 82, so you wanna go up to that 82, all right? If we don't need 82, then I will save on the attribute. So we're just gonna go to 81, okay? Now, the standing dunk, was a 40, so we're not gonna mess with that. Post control, he had a 60 on the post control, so we're gonna go up to 60. That's gonna give us 18, so this is solid. So as you can see, you're not gonna have any issues. You're not gonna have any issues when it comes to finishing around the basket. Close shot, layups, dunks, anything, you're solid. Now, the mid-range shot was a 71, so that's what we're gonna give him. And then his three-point shot was a 73. I promise you, you're gonna be able to spark wide open jump shots with this don't don't even be phased by this all right he had a 79 free throw we're gonna go 79 all right so don't be afraid of this right here you're going to be able to knock him down wide open okay trust me wide open shots i don't know if y'all been seeing my rondo or my derrick rose build but they don't have they got three pointers that's in the 70s and you see how i've been going crazy Pass accuracy was an 84. Let's see, do we need an 84? What happens? Nothing happens. Only thing is the overall, as you can see, is moving. So we don't need to go 84. Let's drop it down. So you know what? We'll just go 83, all right? 83 makes sense because we get post playmaker on Hall of Fame. That's if you want it, so we're gonna definitely do that. The ball handling, he had a 90. So we're gonna definitely give him that 90 ball handle. That's very important. So by going 90, what happens is we get that vice grip, right? If we didn't want to go 90, we could have just left it at the quick first step. But he had 90, so that's what we're going to do. He had an 85 on the speed with the ball, so we're just going to go here, all right? So, so far, this build is looking really, really good, right? Now, 
this is a small forward build so i want to give him all of the attributes that he had all right so the interior we're just going to go with a 60. the perimeter defense was a 70 so we could definitely give him that 70. the steel was a 64. so i want to make sure that i'm giving him all of the attributes that he had 56 on a block which is not bad the offensive was a 43 let's go down real quick let's just go to 50. and then the defensive rebound was a 63 but i'm gonna go up to a 70 so that's gonna give us 12. it's like i said not the most you know what let's, let's build this up to 70 60 and then we're gonna build up the offensive rebound as well so that's 15. so not the best defender but you're a small forward so at least you're going to be able to do a little bit of everything when it comes to this build all right so now we're going back down to the physical so the speed was at 89 right i don't think it makes sense to go 89 what's 89 so we're gonna go all the way up we'll at least get at 89 speed here uh, i'm gonna put all of this to 90 on the stamina the vert was a 73 he had strength oh 60 let's, let's put some strength here and let me see something. 70 okay that's perfect that's perfect i like this a little bit of 88 speed and then we'll put the rest on strength so this build right this small forward build you could be a primary ball handler with this so 18 13 24 and 15 that is amazing the attributes is there this looks like an a fun a uh, small four build that you can run. You can really do damage with a build like this. This is a Tyreek Evans build and I like it. I like it right now, so let's continue. So when I'm thinking about Tyreek Evans and how he hooped when he was on the Kings and he first came into the league, finishing moves, ankle breaking shots, okay? This is definitely him all the way right here, my people. Honestly, Finishing moves was cool, but he wasn't getting contacts like that. This would be better. Okay. Unlocks more effective Euro spin hops. This is Tyreek Evans right here with the ankle breaking shots. This is him all the way. So we're going to continue and see what this build comes out to be, my people. Let's see what this build is going to be. So we have Danny Granger, Jimmy Butler, and Mikael Bridges. Not bad. Not bad. And then we have a slashing point forward. Fantastic. This is a great build name. For Tyreek Evans slashing point forward. That's exactly what he was. Let's test this build real quick. Let's test this build. And I'm going to show you. I'm not going to just give you the best badges. I'm going to go with the badges that I would use. So we get Limitless. We get Poster and Slithery, right? But it's not unlocked yet. So Acrobat, I want that the highest possible. Um, fast Twitch, I want to put that Fast Twitch on. Fearless, I'm going to just go Bronze. Now we have these open, right? I'm coining my limitless off rip. Then I could be able to get the slithery. Now, with all of this available, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this to fearless on silk. That's what I would do. You can switch it up if you want. There's other badges that you could work with, like uh, you got Giant Slayer. There's so many different options that you could go with, right? But this is what I would go with. Honestly, you probably don't even need fast switch. You know, you probably honestly don't even need fast switch unless you're gonna really be around the rim. But Giant Slay would probably be better. But just to get through the video, I'm gonna just go back with the fast switch. All right, shooting, 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 shooting. Claymore, you wanna get that? Mini Magician. Uh, where's Space Creed? Uh, uh, Space Creed is right here. Okay, so now um, these are all on bronze. You don't need them, honestly. Catch and shoot. You can run Green Machine if you want, but it is what it is. And then I'll put the last one on Amp. All right, now. Playmaking, very important. Quick first step, you gotta have that unpluckable. These two is very important. Now these are already unlocked, okay? So, Clan Breaker is a good one to have. Hyperdrive, of course you wanna get Bailout. And now you could get one of these if you wanted. Killer Combos would be nice to have on this build, so I'ma go with the Killer Combos. Ankle Breaker would also be good because he did get a lot of Ankle Breakers. So, I think that would be good, but you know what, I think I will just go with this and then go bail out here. I think that's how I would do it. Now, the defense, right? So we do get chase down, so we're gonna go bronze here. 
going to go with the menace, bronze workhorse, ankle braces, very important. Get your rebound chaser, uh, pick dodger, and then I would just, oh yeah, we do get these ones, right? And we can core these as well. So if you want to get clamps, put clamps. But to be honest, I would rather probably go with Innocent. Yeah, I'd rather go with Interceptor, honestly. Or you could go with Challenger, but I think Interceptor, I really like Interceptor a lot, so I would go with that, and I would just put this right here. And this is how I would do it. Or, if you don't want to go high on a workhorse, just go Chase Stone Artist. I think that would be cool like that, all right? So, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this Tyreek Evans build, and until next time, oh, hold on, I forgot to call one of these. You can actually call Green Machine. There you go, boom, here we go. So, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this build, and until next time, much love.